Well, good evening to you. Welcome to Junior High Basketball Action on Central Illinois Sports. We're live from Perry, Illinois this evening as the Grig... Cash for the things you want by taking advantage of low interest rates. Refinance... your home with Great Rivers Bank and keep more of your money by lowering your monthly payment. Start the process online at greatriversbank.bank and work with one of our experienced loan officers to get the lowest rate possible. Great Rivers Bank, member FDIC and an equal housing lender. Sharing a big family moment. Working hard from home, relaxing with a friend. Welcome to life in the broadband. Age, where reliable internet has never been more important. Cascop keeps your family connected. Connected with consistent speeds up to one gig and Plume Whole Home Adaptive Wi-Fi. Make sure your home's ready for life in the broadband age. Call our local service team. Welcome back on the Great River Spank pregame show. The starting lineups for this contest for the seventh grade PCS Braves. First of all, they're eight and three. Joel Noble and Hayden Granton will start at guards along with Rigston Bonds. Taylor Graham is at a forward, as is Bobby Harris for Grigsville Perry. They'll start at guards. Brody Rush, Caden Nash. The rest are fifth and sixth graders, so they'll be a little bit of a younger squad here tonight against the Braves. Glad you're with us on Central Illinois Sports. Again, we apologize for the lack of data. Um, we're expecting to have a little bit smoother show for you there but uh, we will do our best to bring you the game here tonight on Central Illinois Sports. The Braves are in the visiting red uniforms. Look at the basketball to start the evening as the opening handoff will take place here in a moment. There's a bounce of the ball. We'll wait and see if we're going to have a national anthem. Oh, but it's looking for a game ball it looks like. Always good to have one of those. Our game tonight brought to you in part by Trash Queen, serving Pike, Adams, Scott, and Morgan counties with residential, commercial, and roll-off services. The Harris goes up and under with a shot. It's no good. Gets his own rebound. Puts it back up. And things on here. Out front with the basketball. This Nash will work it over on the wing to Hunter Brown. Brown with the dribble drive. Back out between the circles now to Caden Nash. Nash will try the dribble against Noble to... Brown on the wing right side. Now they'll get it to Rush, top of the key. Rush will try the dribble drive, kicks to the wing. In Brown. Out front it goes to Dorsey, top of the key to Rush. On the left side, Caden Nash gets a touch. He'll work it between the circles to Dorsey. Now it goes to Rush, and he'll be called for traveling. The first turnover of the evening on this Eagles squad as he shuffled the feet Did young Mr. Rush. So the Braves will have team. Hands it off out front to Bonds. Over to... Gratton on the wing. Inside, Harris gets it on a turnaround shot. Good. Bobby Harris with another two, and he makes it a 4 0 PCS advantage with 4.46 to play in the game's opening quarter. Rush with it out front. Passes it off on the wing. Here's Dorsey going to try a three. It rattles in and out. He'll work it to Gratton, who takes it across into the front. An advantage for PCS in a time. would like to thank everyone in our community for your support in the past 15 years. We have over 1,400 square foot of retail space with spirit wear for Unity Mess. Let us help you promote your brand. Decoration methods we offer include screen printing, embroidery, and laser engraving. We are excited to now offer lasered hat patches. With limitations, yours on you, 506 Westwood. Left side for a three. It's not going to fall through. And the rebound down to Joel Noble for PCS. He'll bring the ball out of the front court to Gratton. He's in a little bit of a pickle, out of a trap, throws the ball away. Turnover number one by Pike. Of course, he'll look on the wing to Nash. Nash will try the triple threat, and it's called for traveling. A turnover on Griggsville Perry is their second as he shuffled the feet. They're trying to run the pass and cut, and Coach Hanson trying to get him a little more motion. Here comes Caden Ferguson into the game for the Braves. 
3.43 to play in the first, 7-0 advantage for Pikeland. Into the front court, Bobby Harris with it. He'll drive the lane right to the rim, and shot will go in and out, no good. And Graham is going to be called over the back on the rebound, his first, team first. Alana Express here to serve you with walk-in medical care when you need it. Open 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Every Monday through Friday, Wing gets it off to Sidwell. He'll bounds and finds the hands of Taylor Graham for Pikeland. Into the front court with it come the Braves, and the uh, man and Noble steps on the sideline out of bounds. Turnover number will replace Nodewell. He'll hand it off to Rush. Drives, now kicks top of the key. Sidwell over to Rush for a three. It's off the mark. Rebound comes down to Rush. That was actually Brown that took the shot. Rush got the rebound. Only seventh grader on the squad. Out to Nash. Dribble, now leave it between the circles to Rush. And it will be over and back on the Eagles, their third turnover of this contest. Jacob Jackson in for 147 to play. Pull up off the dribble. Shot won't fall. They'll not be able to penetrate on the dribble. Out to Sidwell. Right side, Thielander now going to be open for a three. It's off the mark. Rebound down to Brody Rush for Briggsville Perry. He'll push, dish it off on the right side. The two second quarter play by play your way after this. BCRE. Re well, ready to start the second quarter of play. And the uh, Pikeland Braves have a 7 2 advantage. Over the. Riggsville Perry Eagles. And the second quarter, seven. It'll work up good. And the rebound will, and Graham will take a chair. 3.38 to play in the second quarter. 7-4 advantage for 